honestly, I don't even play an active role in my life anymore. Shit just happens and I'm like, oh, is this what we're doing now? Okay. six years. This is, for those of you that are new to my channel, the sixth year that I've been doing this video. It wasn't supposed to be an annual thing. Uh, in 2015, when I first filmed this, I just kind of came up with the concept for a haul video, and it was going to be that, and that was going to be it. I had absolutely no idea how many of you were going to love this video. And every year I get asked this question around springtime, which blows my mind. It's like, I can't believe you guys think about this video, love it that much. And I, because of that, because you love it so much and need it, I cannot stop. I have to give it to you. So I'm gonna be doing the annual Dollar Tree candy haul. But you know what? Let's go, let's dive into it. So I'm just gonna grab it random. Oh, this one. The Bloody Bites, they're back. You know, I don't know. Dollar Tree keeps bringing this back. It must be a complete sellout, but you get the blood and then you get the bite. God, I'm gonna try this. I don't know that I've ever tried this on camera, but let's go. Oh my God. me. Why am I doing this? Oh. Oh my god, great flex. Am I supposed to eat with this? I don't understand. A bark, a bark, a bark. Yeah, this is this a no. This is no, NASA. Mm -mm. Two minutes in, it's already it's already a thing. Okay, the next candy is a bag of Twizzlers. I actually don't know if I've ever done Twizzlers on my Halloween candy haul, but this is a snack size. And how many do you actually get in here? Interesting, but it doesn't actually tell you unless I'm just not looking close enough. Candies like these that are gonna be name brand are just gonna be a better bang for your buck from Walmart. But you know what, if you're at Dollar Tree and you're not really using it to hand out candy or if you just don't get that many trick-or-treaters, whatever the case, you know, maybe it's like one of those things where it's just convenience. So I'm not actually going to try this one. <coughs> Who am I kidding? Of course I'm going to try it. I mean, it's candy. Mmm, mm-hmm, mm-hmm, mmm, mm-hmm, mmm, 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 you know? You're as twisty as my life, you know what I'm saying? It's very, it's a very accurate representation of, of how my insides feel, you know? And here's another name brand candy from Dollar Tree. And now and later, original mix, you get apple, banana, strawberry, and cherry in here. I love the packaging. I love the bright colors. You get 40 in here. It's another one of those things where uh, if you're going for quantity, you're better off buying this like at a Walmart. But I have to say that of all the flavors, I probably would go for apple and strawberry, but these are really cute. I love that they're individually wrapped and I also love that the wrappers are the color of the flavor of the candy. Now and later. Huh. That's also a representation of my life. I'm a mess now, I'm a mess later. Mmm, mmm, mm-hmm, 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 mm-hmm. 
It's like 10 a.m. My, my blood sugar level is just gonna hit the roof. The next candies I got doubles of, and I believe that they have definitely made an appearance on my previous Halloween candy hauls, but it's gonna be Laffy Taffy. I love Laffy Taffy. I've been eating this since I was a kid. Love that they put jokes on their wrapper, and I think I've mentioned this before too in previous Halloween candy hauls, but when I was in elementary school, we submitted jokes to Laffy Taffy. I don't know like what ended up happening with that. I have no idea if like our jokes got on there or or what happened, but they're actually pretty hilarious. Here is what the strawberry wrapper looks like. Super adorable. And let's read the joke. What type of load only rises? And upload. Kids say the darndest things. We've been doing a lot of name brand candy so far. We're gonna do another one, which is gonna be Airheads. I love Airheads, it's such a great little candy. And also, individually wrapped, if you can see in here, you get watermelon, blueberry, and the mystery flavor, which I don't even know if I've ever figured out what that mystery flavor is. Does anybody know what it is? You get 12 mini bars in here. If you are, again, going for quantity, don't, don't get this at Dollar Tree. But it is peanut, and tree nut free and gluten free. So if you're wanting to do something that just doesn't have like those um, typical, I guess, allergies for a lot of people, Airheads is gonna be a great candy to go for. And Reese's Cups. I don't even know if Dollar Tree has done it in this form with like the single mini cups before. Maybe they have. I know they've done like the, the round, the ones that are flatter, like, do you know what I'm talking about? These are like pretty thick, but I'm talking about the longer, flatter ones, if that makes sense. I know they've done those, but these, I don't know that they've put these out for Halloween before. Still not at all worth a dollar, in my opinion. I don't even know how many you get in here. They are individually wrapped. Oh, who invented this? Who invented this? And here we have Skittles. I absolutely love the Skittles packaging. I always had have, I love that they've kind of stayed true to their packaging. I don't think that they've changed it for quite some time. We've got the purple, which is always wild berry, and the red, which is always original. Another thing where I would just buy this at Walmart, in at Dollar Tree, you get six uh, individual packs or fun size packs for $1. How should I dress up for Halloween this year? Give me some ideas down below. Off the top of my head, I'm thinking that I'll go as myself because if that's not a nightmare, I don't know what it is. I have so much to say about this next bag of candy. Grab a cup of tea. The Tootsie Roll Pops, okay? I love that the bag is orange, gives it that fall Halloween vibe. There's a couple of things I wanna say. First, don't sleep on Tootsie Roll Pops. I, For me, it's always been one of those candies where I don't automatically think, oh, I want a Tootsie Roll Pop. But the moment I grab one because that's all there is, all of a sudden, it tastes like the best candy in the world. Here's the second thing I'm gonna talk about. This bag is trying to get people excited because it's claiming to be 50% more than the 3.6 ounce bag. Let's do some math, shall we? Let's open this up. We're gonna do what the little owl does. We're gonna count a one, a two, a three, four, five, six, seven, eight, nine. Oh Lord, somebody come stop me from filming. So they couldn't even round it up to 10, but we're getting 50% more than the 3.6 ounce bag. This is the 5.4 ounce bag. So if this is 50% more, then you're trying to tell me that we were previously getting four 
Tootsie Roll Pops. Let's continue on with lollipops, and I love the Bon Bon Booms. They do these all the time from Dollar Tree. These little lollipops are so good. However, I think this is the first time we've ever seen it in a sour. This packaging definitely looks new. They have other Bon Bon Booms that you can get as well. They have like the Dark Midnight ones, which I've done in previous Halloween hauls. The ones that can turn your tongue different colors. I don't typically like sour candies because I can't handle it, but let's see. I mean, she's looking rough. You know, like she just didn't, she just didn't do well in the factory, but let's see. And more lollipops. These are the Charms Mini Pops. I also feel like this is new. I definitely do not, it doesn't spark a memory that I've hauled this for Halloween specifically. So here is the bag. You get 35 pops in here. That's pretty decent. And the amount of flavors is what is incredibly impressive in here. All right, so after going through the entire bag, here are the flavors I did not find. Blue Raz, Bubble Gum, Cotton Candy, Strawberry Lemonade. I didn't find strawberry either. Uh, root Beer Float, Mango, and I believe I did not find Orange Cream unless I mentioned it earlier and I forgot. So there's actually quite a bit of flavors in here that were not in the back. So I don't believe that you are guaranteed. Yeah, as a matter of fact, it says flavor assortment may vary. One of my all time faves is the fun mix. I definitely went back to the last video and I'll link all of my previous candy hauls down below. You can start from 2015. There's been several videos per year, but this one is still at 40 pieces, so they didn't change the quantity on us. And the fun mix is, I just love this. This includes Tiger Pops and Bon Bon Bum. I really don't know why it's bum. I thought it was boom. Bon Bon Boom. But, oh my God, is this a Mandela effect? Um, I don't know that I've hauled before. So I found these cow tails. I've seen these before at Dollar Tree, but I've never seen it in the fall version with the caramel apple. I've also have never tasted the original cow tails, I don't think. Wow, that's a lot. Oh my God. That's a lot of caramel. What the f Oh my God, it's like, Pure sugar. Oh, 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 ah, 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 ah. No, 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 no. Why do I do this video? No. Ah, oh, that's a no. All right, guys, I can't believe this is my sixth year doing this. I love you guys so much. I love that you love my videos, these kinds of videos so much. It's so incredibly fun to do for you guys. Please give this video a thumbs up if you enjoyed. And I don't know if I'm gonna do a second one this year, but if I get a lot of likes and a lot of thumbs up, maybe I'll do a second one. But anyways, thank you guys so much for watching and I'll see you next time, bye. Hi, is this Cow Tales headquarters? Yeah. Okay, listen, the mini caramel apples, girl, no, I about died.